So here's the challenge I want to give the church this summer. I need the church this summer to have no sunscreen. No sunscreen. No sunscreen. No sunscreen. Jesus said, I became the word and dwelt among you. Jesus said, I became the word, became flesh. This is the word of God. This is the son of God. This is the living, breathing word of God. We don't need a sunscreen from this, okay? We need a sunburn from this, amen? We need the word of God burning in our lives. You know what this right here is? Everybody knows what this is. If you grew up as a child or you have children, you know what sunscreen is. Sunscreen protects us, all right, from the harmful effects of ultraviolet rays, meaning the sun can come and do damage to us, so we put sunscreen on. I've been on, sun, I've been on vacation before. I see little dudes running around the pool with them floaties on their arms and everything. I can't even tell what color that kid is. It looks like he's got a fire hose of sunscreen. <laughs> And mama did wore him out with sunscreen on his nose, cheeks, head, ears. I mean, he's just walking around like this and with sunscreen. I'm like, Lord, he couldn't get a sunburn. Ain't no way that kid gets sunburned. I mean, sunscreen all over him. Why? To protect him from what? The harmful effects of ultraviolet rays. Listen to me. I, I ain't got a lick of hair on my head. Shave it every night, all right? I used to have a Jeep. It, it, I, if I didn't put sunscreen on my head, if the light was too long red, it'd burn my head up, man. I'm like, I'm gonna run this thing. If it ain't gonna turn, I'm gonna run. I can feel my head getting hot. And I'm coming up to the next light, and I'm like, Lord, please turn that sucker green. Because if it turns yellow, I gotta stop again. I ain't gonna make it. I ain't gonna make it. Officer, uh, do you know why you ran that red light? Yes, sir. Why you ran that red light? Officer, my head burning like an egg. You're gonna flip me over medium well, because I'm just toasting my head, all right? People say, why do you take your top off your Jeep more? I said, because I burned my head at the red lights. I had to have a cap. I drive, no cap, stop, cap. Drive, I mean, if they try to catch me, that, the guy with the cap, I don't have a cap. I mean, they don't know who's in there. I'm gonna tell you, nothing hurts like your head. You burn your head, ooh, it hurts, man. Hurts, but there is something worse than getting burned on your head. Anybody been burned on the feet? Oh, Lord. Burn the top of your feet. Anybody? I'm, you get in the shower. I, boy, you get in the shower, turn the water on, and you're like, oh, that ain't so bad. And then there is no way you can take a shower and not have water hit your feet. Amen? You're like, woo, woo, do you like Michael Jackson? I mean, you'd be dancing in that shower like, golly. I mean, you're like the Holy Spirit got a hold of you, and you run around the shower trying to stay away from the water. You, you can't. If it hits your feet, it hurts, man. It hurts. And then try to wear socks, then go to bed. Anything touches it. You cannot go to work in a suit in flip flops. It just ain't, ain't right. Ain't right. All right. Some people shouldn't wear flip flops anyway unless you cut your toenails. But that's a whole nother story. I'm just saying to you, man, it hurts. Sunscreen on your feet keeps you from what? Burning your feet. Sunscreen on my head keeps me from roasting my noggin. We absolutely need absolutely zero sunscreen in our lives. We need to spend the summer with the, Lord, with the Lord. Why? Because just like when you have the Holy Spirit living inside of you, it'd be evident that you have the Holy Spirit living inside of you because you're filled with the Spirit. You'll look drunk, but you're not drunk because what you really are is filled with the Spirit. You need more sunburn in your life. You need to let the word of God burn your life so much that everyone that comes in contact with you can see the sunburn in your life. You don't need to put no sunscreen on because the ultraviolet rays from the word of God need to do their beautiful work in your life. Don't put no sunscreen on this summer. You put sunscreen on to protect you from the sun? Uh-uh. You put no S-O-N screen on so that all of the sun can bake on you because we need more of Jesus in our lives. Don't put sunscreen on this summer. 
Let it be that everyone that comes into contact with you this summer can tell that you've been spending time with the Son. Why? Because he's burned into you, man. He's burned into your conversation. He's burned into your thoughts. He's burned into the way you live life. He's burned in everything that you do, man. But everybody that comes around you knows that you've been with Jesus. Let me tell you what will happen this summer. You're going to go on vacation. You're going to go camping in the mountains. You're going to take your trailer somewhere and park it. And everywhere you go, God is already positioned that week for people to be around you. You don't know them, but you're about to know them. You think you're there by accident. You're not there by accident. Everywhere you go, there is always people set up by God. Why? Because God believes that in the month of summer that he created, that his people, his children would have sunburn in their life. That he would, they would so burn for Jesus that when he put them in a campground on an all-inclusive vacation place in Cancun, that people would be there the same week that need to be next to me and you. Why? Because they need to put a little bit of the sun that's burned into our lives into their lives. And you need to not take a vacation from these families that God puts around you, but you are so filled with the Holy Spirit of God that you see what God sees about them. You're gonna go camping. You're gonna go to the mountains. You're gonna go on vacation. You're gonna go to the beach. You can put sunscreen on your feet, keep you from burning up. But I'm gonna say something to you. We need less sunscreen, okay, okay? We need less sunscreen, S-O-N. Man, we need more sunburn, amen. How many of you could use a little more sunburn this summer? Every one of us, every one of us. Do not, in the beauty of summer, and it's no schedule, freedom! All right, just live however you want to, stay up late, whatever. Don't get all sloppy on me. Don't get sloppy on the Lord because some of the greatest things he wants to do in your life, he wants to do when you peer in and look into and dive into the word of God so that he can reflect back his image on you. He wants to burn himself into me and you so that when we walk out to our mission field, you know what? We look like him. We smell like him. We act like him. So I want you to do me a favor when you go to Walmart or Target or wherever you go and you see a big old rack of sunscreen, let it remind you. Number one, put it on your head and put it on your feet, right? But number two, I don't need sunscreen S-O-N in my life. I need more sunburn in my life.